Hello everyone and today I'm going to show you the new free menu system that is going to be added to the JR development shop. I'm going to show you how to edit the scripts, how to actually organize the files properly and how to actually set it up. So to begin with you're going to go download the file and drag and drop it into your studio. Then you're going to have a version 1 file, a bit like this. It will be saved to a file and it will be called just version 1 menu. And then all you'd do to get that, you'd come here to where your downloads are or wherever you downloaded it to, which I can't remember where, which is here, and you drag and drop it, place it in. There you go, you've got it. Okay. To set this up, what we're going to do is we're going to place lighting in lighting, then control U or just ungroup. Then replicated storage needs to go in replicated storage, ungroup that. Service group service, that's going to be there, ungroup. Start GUI is there, ungroup. And Teams is going to be there, and ungroup. Right, now that we've done that, first we need to set up some things before we do anything else. First thing we need to set up is the Webhook reporting system. So as you can see, this is all commenta uh, commented, so you just need to change this, and you need to change this. To get a webhook, what you do is you get your Discord, you open it, you go to the uh, place you want, integrations, webhooks, add new webhook, here, rename it, so this would be called uh, reports, file save, copy URL, you can change that when you want, and then what we're going to do is we're going to place it in here, and we're going to delete from this point to this point, and boom. And we can copy this from here again just to make our lives easier and just paste it in. Now that we've done that, that is the simple section. And if it's all basic like this, it should all be set up and working. As you can see, we've got shadows and we can turn all the settings off or all back on. We've got our moderator tab, which is the reporting is civilian. So if I wanted to say this person is exploiting, what I do is do this. Press report sends report and then if we come to discord we can see new civilian report reason for report exploiting this is your username and this is the person that you've just reported and if you want to report a police officer it would be the same way uh cuff rushing report then you come over to your discord tab and you can see new police report so you can send these to two different channels so if you've got high ranks in a different department or service you can send it to their uh, Discord channels instead of the main one. Uh, these can come to your moderator files as well. So you can set them up. So again, it's just two different webhooks. Okay, now that we've done that, I'll show you the team changer. This is the team changer. Uh, I can change to civilian. As you can see. But if I wanted to change to police force, I can also change to police force. And if I wanted to change to any of the others, I can just click the button and it changes. There we go. Now I'm just going to show you how to set up the group and the group rank setting. These are really easy to set up. All you're going to have to do is come into the start UI, go to main UI, go to UI, go to menu, open menu, click that, click that, click that, scrolling frame. Okay, now you've got the main thing. If you want to be able to see it, all you've got to do is enable it. Then you can come into, say you want to change police force, open this, frame, text button, and you've got a group file. All you need to do is get your group ID of the group that you're using. Now if I wanted to do that, all I'd do is I'd come over to the group, copy and paste that, and then I'd paste that in there, just like that. And then minimum rank, I just set to whatever rank I want, is the minimum that can join that team. So for example, 255, which would be the owner of the group. And then what I can do is make that un-enabled. And as you can see, if I go to the team changer and click police, I can now join the police force. So it's as simple as that. Settings are all set up, moderator tab's all set up, and that tab's all set up. This is a timer, uh, just for general clock use. 
all you have to do to set that up is have a team change ring at uh, a time changer so just change this to 12 uh, you need to use like a proper team change I'm being stupid uh, but yep yeah, that's how to set up the system if you haven't if you have any questions join the discord uh, and open a ticket and then you'll be able to see and we'll guide you through what's wrong um, this is just a normal uh, notes and you can delete that and that's the version one of the menu uh, version two will be coming out uh, after christmas we think and it will have more options like a proper moderator tab where you can ban kick warn fling and some other fun commands that may be useful um, and then we may have another tab but i can't mention what that is that's a little secret uh, this is free so if you want it join the discord discord is in the description Thank you and have a brilliant rest of your day. Bye bye.